jarabe al doctor. Mínimo, mínimo. Teacher. Ajá, hello. Bueno, lo vamos a sancionar. Who are you, teacher? Venía de desfilar con las misas, por eso es que no venía. I tried all the codes, sorry. Intenté todos los codes para iniciar, a hacer aquí. So. Ahora entiendo cuando ustedes no pueden entrar. Bienvenido a la realidad, Ticho. Ok. Ok, very good. Now, eh, vamos a reponer entonces. Perdón. Ok, give me a second. Good. Now, let's begin. I will open everything, right? Tengo que abrir todos los archivos, así que regálenme unos segunditos. Dele, que aquí ha estado buena la plática. Ah, ok. ¿En inglés o Spanish? Super Spanish. Oh, Super Spanish. No, 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 no. Todavía no tenemos el nivel. What time is it? Eh, perdimos 23 minutos, ¿verdad? Vamos bueno, a ver. No haber receso, señores. No los perdimos, hemos socializado un poco. Ok. Ah, tranquilo, teacher. Bueno, vamos a ver si. ¿Qué me dicen acá en inglés corporativa? Déjenme ver un segundito. Ok. Eh, class number 12, right? Let's continue with the present simple. Present simple. Ok, give me a second. Que, eh, o me comenta, pues serían alrededor de 22 a 23 minutos. Hola, teacher. En el caso, sí, estarían respondiendo que son los minutos correspondientes. Que, eh, o me comenta, pues serían alrededor okay. de 22 a 23 minutos. Ok. Very good. Ahorita estamos abriendo los archivos. Sorry. Regálenme otros segunditos más perdidos. Sorry. Ok. Y aquí estamos. Virtual Books. Interchange. Y aquí está el recurso. Yes. Ok, now. Let's begin. With the review of the yes no question and the information question, right? Comparison. We're going to make an exercise. Okay, give me a second here. Estamos. Okay, listen, please. Page 39, exercise 7, grammar focus. Simple present questions. Do you get up early? No, I get up late. Does he eat lunch at noon? No, he eats lunch at one o'clock. Do they take the bus to class? No, they take the subway. What time do you get up? At ten o'clock. What time does he have dinner? At eight o'clock. When do they take the subway? On Tuesdays and Thursdays. Okay, this is the difference between the yes no question and the information question. Right now we're going to repeat the exercise we made yesterday. And this is the exercise, right? Uh, do you check your email every day? Yes, I check my email every day. Number two. Help me please. You want what time lunch do eat? What is the correct question here? Help me, please. What time do, do you? you... Uh -huh. what, time what time do you? you... Lunch eat. Lunch eat. Mm. Lunch. Eat lunch. Eat lunch. Eat lunch. Eat lunch. Eat lunch. <laughs> eat lunch. <laughs> okay, very good. What time do you eat lunch? Correct. Next one. Uh, at star does eight o'clock this class. Does does 
The subject this class start. start. So this class at eight o'clock. Start at eight o'clock. Not today, right? Not today. For the teacher. <laughs> eight o'clock. Hoy no, for the teacher. Que tardó. Sorry. Does this class start at eight o'clock? Good. Number four. Study you. Do you, do when? you study? Ah, uh, but when? Uh, when okay. do you study? When do you, do you study English? Do you study English? Good. And the last one, right? On weekends, you and your friends do play sports. Do you and your friends? Do you and your friends play notice, sport? Not notice that the subject is very long, right? Todo esto es el sujeto. You and your friends uh -huh. play sports on weekends. Do you and your friends play sports on weekends? On weekends. Okay, very good. Now, number one, yes, no question or information question. Number one. Yes, yes, no, no question. question. Yes, yes, no question. Yes, no question. Correct. Number two. Yes, no question or information question. Information. Information, information. question. Good. Number three. Information question or yes, no question. Information. Yes, no information. Question. Mm. question. Yes, no question. Yes, no question. Right. Okay. Number four. Information. Oh, yes, no. Yes, no. Informa Informa Information. 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 <laughs> Come on. So ya estamos ahí eh, confundiendo. Vamos a ver, okay. Number five. Do you and your friends play sport? Yes, no question or information question? Yes, no question. Excellent. Yes, no question. You see? So every time, every time you see, every time you see, a WH word, what, when, for example, right? Uh, you have an information question or WH question, right? Okay, good. Notice the difference, right? So uh, when I say, do you, yes or no? Does this class, no, yes, no. Do you and your friends play, yes, we. But when I say what, I say at one, what time, you know, at one o'clock. And when I say when, in the evening, right? Now we're going to see more examples like this. And let's go to page 64 here. Right? Okay, before to start, we're going to practice a conversation. Listen, please. Page 64, Exercise 2, Conversation. I love sports. Listen and practice. So, Justin, what do you do in your free time? Well, I love sports. Really? What sports do you like? My favorites are hockey, baseball, and soccer. Wow! You're a really good athlete. When do you play all these sports? Oh, I don't play these sports. What do you mean? I just watch them on TV. Okay. Now, repeat, please. Listen and repeat. Listen and practice. Listen and repeat. So, Justin, what do you do in your free time? Notice that is, what do you do in your free time? But the, the, the woman say, what do you do? What do you do? Okay, now, continue. Listen and repeat. Well, I love sports. Okay. 
Really? What sports do you like? My favorites are hockey, baseball, and soccer. Wow! You're a really good athlete. When do you play all these sports? Oh, I don't play these sports. What do you mean? I just watch them on TV. Okay, now again, repeat us to me, please. Repeat us to me. So, Justin, what do you do in your free time? So, Justin, what do you do in your free time? Marcela, repeat, please. What do you do in your free time? What do you do in your free time? Okay, Glenda, what do you do in your free time? What do you do in your free time? What do you, what do you? What, what do you? Uh-huh. Do? In your free time. In your free time. Good, thank you. Now, Marlon, what do you do in your free time? Okay, uh, Mario, please. What do you do in your free time? What do you do in your free time? Good, that's it. Sorry, teacher. No había encendido el micrófono. Me estaba hablando. Pensaba que lo había dicho. Ah, okay. Well, say, say it again, Marlon. Marlon, come on. What do you do in your free time? What do you do in your free time? Excellent. Good. Everybody, everybody, repeat. Well, I love sports. Well, I love sports. Really? Really? What sports? Really? What sports do you like? What sport do you like? My favorites are hockey, baseball, and soccer. Wow, you're a really good athlete. Athlete. <coughs> I'm sorry. When do you play all these sports? Oh, I don't play these sports. What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? You know, short. What do you mean? I just watch them on TV. Watch them. Watch them. I just watch them on TV. Good. Now, two volunteers, please. Lauren and Justin, two volunteers. Hi. Excuse me? Hi. Okay, thank you, Saul. Saul, you're Justin. I need a Lauren, please. A Lauren? Hi, teacher. Okay, Mario, thank you. So, Saul, uh, Justin, uh, Mario, Lauren. Ready? One, two, three. Action. So, Justin, what do you do in your free time? Well, I love sports. Really? What sports do you like? My favorites are hockey, baseball, and soccer. Wow, you're a really good athlete. When do you play all these sports? Oh, I don't play these sports. What do you mean? I just watch them on TV. Very good. What do you mean? What do you do? 
What do you mean? What do you do? Right? Good. Two more volunteers, please. Two more volunteers. Two more volunteers to practice this conversation. Me. Uh, so, uh, Jorge, please. Jorge, you're Justin. I need a, a Lauren, please. A Lauren. Volunteer. Hello, teacher. Okay, Yo Marcela. Está... Marcela, Marcela. Okay, good. And por ahí alguien más dijo. La dejamos para tercera vuelta. <laughs> No, no lo dije. <laughs> ah, ok, Glenda. Glenda. Eh, number three, right? Number three for you. Ok, now, for the moment, Marcela and Jorge, right? Ok, ready? Action. So, Justin, what do you do in your free time? Well, I love sports. Really? What sport do you like? My favorite are hockey. Baseball, soccer, and soccer. Wow. You're really good athlete. Where do you play all their sport? Oh, I don't play these sports. What do you mean? I just watch them on TV. Good. Thank you very much. Now, listen to me. Uh, well, for a moment, I thought Jorge was saying uh, hockey, baseball, soccer, and capirucho. <laughs> but no. It's so kind of trade, right? Uh, okay, Marcela, uh, these sentences, look, when I say, what do you mean? Uh, you can say two ways. You can say, what do you do? Or what do you do? What, what do, do you, you do? do? Uh -huh, excellent, yes. Or oh, here, look, what do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? Listen to the audio again. Listen to the audio again. Look. Page 64, exercise 2. List. So, Justin, what do you do in your free time? What do you do, huh? You see? What do you do? And the other one? When do you play all these sports? Oh, I don't play these sports. Pay attention. What do you mean? What do you mean? Listen. What do you mean? Uh -huh. What do you mean? You can say, what do you mean? Or you can say, what do you mean? Right? Okay? Good. Thank you. Now, uh, next one, please. Uh, Glenda and... Glenda is Lauren. I need a Justin. Justin. Hello, Justin. Hi, teacher. Okay. Saul. Thank you, Saul. So, ready? Glenda and Saul. One... Two, three, action. So, Justin, what do you do in your free time? Well, I love sports. Really? What sport do you like? My favorites are hockey, baseball, and soccer. Wow, you really like good athlete? Where do you play and the sport? Oh, and don't play these sports. Why are you me? I just watch them on TV. Okay, look at this, right? It says, uh, what do you do in your free time? What do you do? What do you mean, right? Okay, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Now, let's continue, right? Let's continue. Teacher, a question. Yes, tell me. Este, uh, these uh, questions are linked sounds. Linked sounds, correct. Exactly, Mario. Yeah, linked sounds. So it's not thank, what thank do you. you mean, but what do you, what do you, what do you, right? And just pay attention in the parts, the four parts of the information question, right? Uh, Doodle is coming here and is going to tell the four parts if you want, right? Doodly? Uh, yes. Okay. It says, what sports do you like? What, one, do, two, you, three, like. So there are four parts. Four parts. Okay, yes, four parts. What do you like? So in this case, it's what is one, do is the auxiliary, you is the subject, and like is the verb. What do you mean? 
what do you mean? Four part, right? Talking about this four part class, uh, let's check it out here, the information question. Listen, please. Page 65, exercise three, grammar focus. Simple present WH questions. What sports do you play? I play hockey and baseball. Who do you play baseball with? I play with some friends from work. Where do you play? We play at Hunter Park. How often do you practice? We practice once or twice a week. When do you practice? We practice on Sundays. What time do you start? We start at 10 o'clock in the morning. Okay, good. So we have here the question. What sports, who, where, how often, when, and what time? What is the answer of this? What sport? Hockey and baseball. Who? Friends. From friends. Where? Hunter Park. How often? Frequency. Once or twice a week. When? Sundays. What time? 10 o'clock. So this is the answers of the questions. What sport, who, where, how often, when, and what time. Notice that you don't say, eh, where do you play? Where do you play? Yes, I do. <laughs> no, right? Oh, no, I don't. No, no. It's specific information. If they say where, you say Hunter Park, eh, Cuscatran Park, you know. Be nice, be nice. <laughs> okay. Inauguration. Okay, so you say where is a place. It's a place when you say it. when is time. Who is people? Specific information, right? Okay, we're going to practice, but before I will take the attendance, please say present, Ana Maria. Brian? Present. Uh, Ana Maria, okay, good. Thank yes. You. Okay, Brian? Claudia? Present. Oh, welcome, Claudia. Uh, Chris? Present. Thank you. Thank you very much. Daisy? Miss Castellanos Arevalo? Dago? Present. Thank you. Uh, Glenda? Present. Griselda? Present. Mr. Orellana Membreño? Present. Thank you. Uh, Josué? Present. Thank you, Mr. Castillo Gaitan. Uh, Carolina? Present. Thank you and welcome. Marcela? Present, teacher. Thank you very much. Uh, Mario, Ernesto? Present, teacher. Thank you, Mario. Present, teacher. Thank you, Mr. Olano. Marlon? Mr. Gomez? Marlon? What happened with Marlon? Present teacher. Ah, yeah, yeah. Good. Yes, good, good. Thank you. Uh, maybe? Miss Rivera Ramirez? No, Otmar? Ese present, lo ah, siento okay. que voy a hacer no. porte. Ah, okay, maybe. Cuando llegue a casita me avisa. Okay, thank you, Otmar. Saul? I'm here. Good, thank you. And Jansi? Miss Alvarez, are you? Oh, good. Thank you. Welcome. Aquí, yeah. <laughs> Excellent also. Yes. Okay. Let me see. I only listen. Uh -huh. Chris. Good, Chris. Eh, perdón que me mandaron un montón de mensajes al chat y no me quedó tiempo de verlo. Sorry. Estaba afligido ahí queriendo abrir. Okay. So, Chris, está de oyente. ¿Alguien más está de oyente? Nadie más. Todos están activos. Okay. Good. Excellent also. Let's continue. So, please, Ana Maria, you make the questions, please. And uh, Claudia, you make the answers. Ana Maria, the questions. Claudia, the answer. Ready? One, two, three, action. What sport do you play? I play hockey and basketball. Baseball? Go on. And Base baseball. Baseball, yeah, it's good. Ana Maria? Who do you play? 
baseball with baseball baseball Ana María baseball. who do you play baseball with I play with some friends from work. Where do you play? We play at Hunter Park. Yes. Who, who often do you practice? We practice once, um, once, once, or twice, or twice a week. Mm -hmm. When do you practice? Practice? We practice? practice on Sundays. What time do you start? We start at 10 o'clock in the morning. Okie dokie. Now let's practice again. Thank you, Claudia. Thank you, Ana Maria. Questions. Listen and repeat, please. Everybody, repeat. What sports do you play? Come on, repeat. I play hockey and baseball. Who do you play baseball with? I play with some friends from work. Where do you play? We play at Hunter Park. How often do you practice? We practice once or twice a week. When do you practice? We practice on Sundays. What time do you start? We start at 10 o'clock in the morning. Good. Notice that when I say who do you play baseball with, the preposition with is at the end, right? This is because we cannot place the preposition after who. Who with do you play verbal? No, 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 no. It's not correct, right? We have to uh, uh, to put the, the preposition with at the end, right? It's like when you say, for example, other example is this. Look, um, who uh, or what music, what music, do you do you listen to right so the preposition is at the end right it's not what to music do you listen or is okay uh oh well this is the the use of with uh and then notice that that here i say I play with some friends right so you you use the preposition after the verb right okay good now, again, pay attention in this. The answer for what sports is hockey and baseball. The answer for who is some friends. The answer for where is Hunter Park, right? The answer for how often, con que frecuencia, right? How often is once or twice a week, right? When the answer is on Sundays. And what time I have a question. is 10 o'clock, right? Yes? What does it mean once or twice a week? Uh, once is one time. One time. Twice one time. is two, two times. Once is one time. And twice is two times. Okay? Oh, okay. So you can say, uh, uh, we practice once 
Now, I will practice one time or two times a week. It's correct. One time or two times a week. Correct. No problem. Or you can say once or twice, right? It's option. It's an option. Good. Now, and remember, we have the four parts. For example, where do you play? Where do you play? When do you practice this? Okay, four parts, right? The four parts. Now, it's time to work. It's time to work. And let's start with conversation one, right? Good. It says, complete the conversations with, um, with the correct WH question. In this case, no more yes, no question. All of these are the structure one, two, three, and four part, right? For example, I watch sports on TV every weekend. Really? What sports do you like? It One, two, three, four, right? What sports do you like to watch? Soccer uh, is my favorite. Now, do you usually watch soccer? Uh, the answer is Sunday. So what is the, the, the question in this case? Who, what time, when, where? Uh, what time? How often? Sorry? What, what time? time? Mm. But when I say what time, I say three o'clock, four o'clock. When? When, correct. Okay. When do you usually? When, when do you usually, right? Okay. Uh, Give me a second. When do you, right? No, no, wait a minute. When? Uh -huh. When do you usually? When do you usually? Uh, um, watch, sorry, watch soccer, right? On Sundays. When? On Sundays. Okay. And at home? No, I'm at my friend's house. What is my friend's house? Is a person, is a place, is a frequency, is time. What is my friend's house? What is my friend's house? Okay, look at the option. Look, what sports, who, where, how often, when, or what time? Where, thing. Where, correct, yes. Where? Okie dokie. Because we're talking about a place, right? So it's where? Where do you usually watch it, right? At home. No, at my friend's house, this is right now. Please repeat after me. Repeat after me. I watch sports on TV every weekend. Really? What sport do you like to watch? Soccer. It's my favorite. When do you usually watch soccer? On Sunday afternoons. And where do you usually watch it? At home? No. At my friend's house. He has a really big TV. A big TV, right? 
enormous. Cubre todo el dormitorio ahí. Mario's TV, for example, right? Very big. <laughs> okay, good. Now, uh, Dago, please, your letter A. And Glenda, your letter B. Ready? One, two, three, action. I watch a sport on TV every weekend. Really? What a sport do you like to watch? Soccer. It's my, it's my favorite. <laughs> when do you usually watch soccer? On Sundays afternoons. Um, and where do you usually watch it? At home? No, at home, my friend's house. He has a really big TV. Thank you very much. And notice that when we say watch it, right? So we say watch it, right? Watch it. Ling sound. Ling sound. Thank you very much, Dago. Thank you very much, Glenda. Now, please help me now, eh, Griselda and Jorge, right? Griselda, your letter A, Jorge, letter B. Action. I watch sports on TV every weekend. Really? What sport do you like to watch? Soccer is my favorite. When do you usually watch soccer? On Sunday afternoons. And where do you usually watch it? At home? No, at my friend's house. He has really a big tea. Okie dokie. Thank you, right? Now let's go to the second conversation. Let's go to the second conversation. It says, mm, When, what, where, how often, what sports? What is the question? It says, about once a where month. Where do you go? Where do you go by riding? Mm, no. Once a month when, is not a place. When? 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 when what? Do you yes. What do you... But how do you say con qué frecuencia? What sport? Okay. Who? Where? How often? Oh. When, or what time? How often? What? How often? How often? Very how good. Often. How often? Con qué frecuencia? Con qué frecuencia, right? Okay, good. Now, what is the question here? How often do you go by riding, right? Okay. How often? How often do you go by riding? Oh, about once a month. I love to go by riding. I go every Saturday. Really? One o'clock. One o'clock. What time? What time? One o'clock, right? Oh, yeah. And it says, my sister. What is my sister? Who, Who right? Who do you usually play, do you usually go with? Oh, my sister. Come with us next time, right? Good. Repeat after me, please. Repeat after me. How often do you go by riding? Oh. 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 About once a month. About once a month. Repeat, please repeat. I love to go bike riding. I love to go bike riding. I go every Saturday. Really?
What time do you go? Usually at about one o'clock. Oh, yeah? Who do you usually go with? Who do you usually go with? My sister. My sister. Come with us next time. 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 Yeah. Okay, very good. Now to volunteers. No, oh, no, volunteers no. Let me take some people here in the in the list, right? Uh, Ernesto, yes, right. Mario, no, right? Oh, no, no, sorry. The last participant were. Sorry, sorry. Give me a second. Griselda and Jorge, right? Okay, good. Now it's Josue. Josue and Carolina. Josue, are you ready? Mr. Josue Armando Castillo. Mr. Castillo. Hello, Josué. Sí, sí. Oh, yeah, good. <coughs> uh, conversation two, Josué. Your letter A, letter A. And Carolina, your letter B. Ready? Okay. Action. How often do you go by already? Oh, at work. Once. Once. Yo soy A. No, your B. Correcto, ya. Yeah. Oh, uh -huh. I put um a month. No, wait, wait a minute, Carolina. About once. Ah, okay. About um a month. No, 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 sorry, excuse me. Once. Once. once? A month. A month. Good, thank you. Continue, Josué. I love to go bike reading. I go every Saturday. Really? What time do you go? Usually at, a, at about one o'clock. Oh, yeah. What do you usually go with? My sister can wait use next time. Okay, thank you very much, right? Notice it says bike riding, bike riding, right? And then it says, who, who, who do you, who do you? And then this says, this says, come with us, come with us. Come, baby, come, baby, come, baby, come. Come with us, right? Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Carolina and Josue. Now, next is going to be uh, Marcela and Ernesto. Marcela, your A. Ernesto, your B. Ready? Okay. One, two, yes. three. Action. Who often do you go big ride? Bike riding? Oh, uh, what? Bike, bike riding? Bike riding? Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, about, about once a month. I love to go big ride. Bike, go. sorry, bike riding. <laughs> bike riding. Mm -hmm. Yes. I go every Saturday. Really? When time do you go? Usually at about one o'clock. Oh, yeah. Who do you usually go with? My sister. Come with you. Come, Come with. Oh, with us. With us. With Come us. with us next time. Okie dokie, thank you very much. Excellent, also, right, Marcela? Thank you. And Ernesto, very good. Now, Mario, please, your A. And Marlo, your B. Ready, boys? One, two, three. Action. How often do you go by riding? 
Brazo. 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 Oh, about one amount. I love to go by riding. I go every Saturday. Really? What time do you go? Usually at about one o'clock. Oh, yeah. Who do you usually go with? My sister. Come with us next time. Okie dokie. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, right, for the your cooperation. Now, uh, we are going to finish this practice with this question, right? So complete the conversation with WH question, right? Then compare with a partner. WH question. Now, the clue are, uh, what sports do you like? I like a lot of sports. I usually play with my sister. Sister, right? Sister. My sister, right? And some friends. We practice on Saturdays. Saturdays. We start about noon. And in our yard. Okay? Or it says we sometimes play on the beach. That is other place, right? Now, what is the correct question? Let me see. Number one. Number one, please. Uh, can you help me? Mm, maybe. No, no, maybe todavía está en transporte, okay. Uh, Otmar, please, Otmar. Number two. What is the question in number two, Otmar? Where do you play? What or who? Because he says my sister, right? And some oh. friends. Who? Oh. Who? Excellent. Who do you Excuse me. Who do you play with? I usually play with my sister and some friends. Okay. Now, uh, we practice on Saturday. Saul, please. What is the question? When, where, who, what time? Do you practice? Sorry, repeat. When do you practice? When do you practice? Correct. When do you practice? When do you practice? We practice on Saturday, right? Good. Noon. Uh, Jansi? What is the question, Jansi? When I say noon. It's 12 o'clock, right? 12 o'clock. So what is the question, Jansi? I'm the teacher. What is the question when I say noon? Mm. I will give you a, a, a joker, right? Eh, le vamos a dar un, un comodín, Jans. ¿Quiere llamada, <laughs> llamada al público o 50-50? 50-50. Eh, llamar al público. Llamar al público, ok, permítame. Ahorita vamos a llamarle aquí. Vamos a llamarle a alguien que anda con gripe, pero que se sabe la respuesta. Ok, okay eh, good evening, Mario. Do you copy? Hello. Hi, teacher. Hi, hello. Uh, Mario, uh, can you tell me what is the correct question when I say start at about noon or 12 o'clock? It's the same, right? What time? What time? Are you sure? Because it's noon. Okay, it's about good. noon. Thank you. Thank you very much. Goodbye. Have a good night. God bless you. Right. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> Okay, uh, Jancy, I, I call a friend. It's a good friend, you know. He <laughs> he, he loves semita with coffee. 
Yes. Okay, Jancy. The this friend says that the answer is what time? Do you believe in the public, Jancy? Yes or no? Uh, yes. Yes. Okay. So the answer is what time? Okay. What time? What Do you time? right? Do you? Do you start? What time do you start? Correct. It's correct. The answer, Jancy. Thank you. Gracias por confiar. Thank you, tiempo. Mario. Yeah, thank you. Mario is... You're welcome. He's ready to answer, right? <laughs> Good. Thank you. Now, Ana Maria, please. The answer is in or jar. So what is the correct question, Ana Maria? How? How? Hmm, when I say how is como, right? De que manera? De que forma? But when I say in our jar, in nuestro patio, what is patio, right? What is, is who, where, when, what time, what? Como din, Ana Maria? Joker? Yes. Yeah. Yes, eh, ¿cuál quiere? 50-50, 50-50 o llamada al público. ¿Cuál comodín quiere, Ana María? Hola. ¿Llamada al público? 50-50 o le preguntamos a Dino. Yes, Dino, Dino, I know the answer. A Dino. Okay, pay attention. Only for you, Ana Maria, is where? Where? You got it? Bye. Uh huh, Ana Maria, what is, what is the answer? When? When, correct. Huh? When? Excuse me, the answer is where? <laughs> where? Where is the answer? <laughs> Where? Sorry, Ana Maria. Yeah. Este se Where, right? Good. Perdón, Ana Maria. Le digo mal como din ahí. So, it's where, right? Where do you play, right? Where do you play? In or jar? You play in or jar, right? It's a place, right? Good. Repeat us to me, please. What sports do you like? I like a lot of sports. But I really love volleyball. Who do you play with? I usually play with my sister and some friends. When do you practice? We practice on Saturdays. What time do you start? We start at about noon. Noon. Mediodía, hora del sopa, right? Noon. Where do you play? We usually play in our yard. But sometimes we play at the beach. But sometimes we play at the beach. Okay, thank you. Now, question and answer. Question and answer, right? Okay. Eh, Claudia, ¿ya se conectó nuevamente, Claudia? Sí, yes. yes, okay, good. Claudia, question number one. Dagoberto, answer number one. Okay, come on. 
what Later, is so later. Uh huh. What? Uh, Dígame. Creo que el micrófono le está fallando, Claudia. Otra vez. What sports? What sport do you like? Dago. I like a lot of sports, but I like I really love volleyball. Thank you, Glenda. Next question, please. Griselda, letter B. Answer right with my sister and some friends. Okay, ready? One, two, three. What do you do play with? Again, who do you? Who do you play with? I usually play with my sister and some friends. Okie dokie. Jorge, please make the question to Josue. Repeat. Make the question with Jose. When do you practice? Uh -huh. Only read the Letter question. A. Uh huh. Please. A. What sport do you like? No, 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 no. Uh, uh, number three. Oh, sorry. And uh, one, two, three. When do you practice? Jose. Mr. Castillo Gaitan. Uh, uh, we practice on Saturday. Okie dokie. Okay, thank you. Now, uh, Carolina, please. Carolina, make the question. Marcela, the answer. What time do you start? We start about noon. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Ernesto Tomario, please. Uh, where do you play? Mario? Mario? Mr. Hello, teacher. Please, the last answer, please, let it be. Where do you play, Mario? We usually play in our in our yard, but sometimes we play at the beach. Okie dokie, right? So any extra question about this? Any extra question? No? Okay. So we're going to go to the manual. Vamos a ir al manual. Uh, recuerden que el, manu el manual lo pueden imprimir si quieren, right? Okay. Okay. We are here, right? Uh okay, yeah, here, right? Now please let me share with you. Manual, manual, this is the manual, yes. Right? What do I do? Or what do you do, right? I supervise. Where do you work? I work in the accounting department, right? Uh-huh. When do you do we go to the minutes, right? We go to the minutes two times a week. How do you como? How do you plan the marketing? They investigate the customer's need, right? And um, what time do you take breakfast? Excuse me, excuse me. I take breakfast at 8 o'clock. No, 8 a.m., excuse me, right? Now, what are the questions, class? What are the questions? The questions are, number one, I have to write a report about the production Every Friday. Every Friday, right? So here we have two options, right? What? What? Or how often, right? How two possibilities. Mm -hmm. What or how often? In the number two, blue building. What is blue building? It's a person, it's a place, it's a frequency, it's time. What is blue building? La, el edificio azul. 
azul. Edificio azul. So what is? Where? Mm -hmm, correct. Where do you Ma work? Maria and I start working at 10 p.m. What is this? What time? What time, right? What time? Very good. And we design and others create. What is this? Uh, what time? How? When? Who? How? 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 Very good. And number five. Este todavía no lo he enseñado, ¿verdad? But it's why. Why, right? Let's do it together. Help me, please. Let, I'm going to start. Number one, everybody, help me, right? I have to write a report about the production every Friday. So remember there are fours. WH word, auxiliary, subject, and verb. WH word, auxiliary, subject, and verb, right? So what is the WH word? In number one. What? What, what do you have? What? What? Auxiliary? Do? Subject? What do you? And what is the verb? What do you? Uh, write. What do you What do have? you write? Mm. What do you have? Uh, sorry. Do, do you have to write? Mm. Write. What do you have to write? Or oh, other possibilities? How, when do you write a report every Friday? But this is okay. What do you have to write? Good. Number two. Where do you work? Where, Where do you work? work? Because we're talking about a place, right? So it says where. Do you work? Remember, four part, right? Where? Cling. Do. Cling. You. Cling. And work. Cling. You see? It's a place, right? Now, next one. At 10 p.m. So what is the question? Uh, what time? Do you start? Do you start working, right? What time do you start working? Maria and I start working at 10 p.m., right? Good. Number four. The question was how, right? Okay. How do you? How do you? How do you design? Design? How do you design? How do you design? Right. Design. Okay. And the last one. They have a meeting because we have to. So I will explain this. Why? Este no lo he explicado, verdad? Why? Por qué? Por qué motivo? Why? Auxiliary? Auxiliary? Why, why do you... Do you? Uh -huh. What is the subject? You, right? Do you? Have a meeting? Have a How meeting. do you have a meeting? Why do you have a meeting? Because we have to talk about the inflows and the outflows. Good. Repeat after me, please. What do you have to write? I have to write a report about the production every Friday. Where do you work? I work in the blue building. What time do you start working? What time do you start working?
Maria and I start working at 10. How do you design? We design and others create the new product. And number five, repeat, please repeat. Why do you have a meaning? Why do you have a meaning? No, do they, excuse me. Aquí nos equivocamos. Es, en lugar de you, era they, ¿verdad? Sorry, oso, oso ahí. Vamos a corregirlo. Give me a second. Why do they? Si el teacher se equivoca, corríjame también, ¿verdad? Why do they have a meaning? Repeat, please. Why do they have a meaning? They have a meeting because we have to talk about the inflows and outflows. We have to talk about the inflows and outflows. Money, right? Money. Good. Now, the five questions are going to be repeated by, let me see. Donde nos quedamos. Sorry, ya me perdí. Eh... No, I don't remember. No me acuerdo dónde nos quedamos. So, eh, vamos a ver, Glenda y Griselda, please. Glenda, you make the questions. Griselda, the answer, right? Are you ready? Option. Why do you have to write? I have to write a report about the production every Friday. Where do you work? I work in the blue building. What time do you start working? Maria and I start working at 10 p.m. How do you design? Design? design, design? design. How do you design? We design in order to create the new product. We do they have a meeting? Why? A meet? Why do they? Why do, do they have a meet? Meeting? Me meeting? Why do they have a meeting? Good. They have a meeting because we have to talk about the inflows in outflows. Okie dokie. Thank you very much, right? So this is the exercise. I guess we practice a lot with the information question. But we have more. We have more, right? So we have more examples. We're going to work here. Look. In page. Oh, but this is interesting. Look. This part is inter interesting, right? This this part we can work uh, together. But I have some news for you, right? Tengo algunas noticias para ustedes. Yes. Um, lamentablemente, eh, me falló el internet y no solo el internet, porque cuando estaba reanizando la cuenta de Zoom, me falló la cuenta de Zoom. Así que tuve que pedir código, me ayudaron ahí los compañeros de inglés corporativo. Y yeah. ya. Pero en todo eso perdimos como unos 20 minutos. Así es que la mala noticia es que tenemos que quedarnos tarde. ¿Verdad? Si tiene alguien que ir a hacer cena o, o algo urgente, pues yo voy a entender. Pero los que quieran quedarse conmigo hasta las, hasta las 10 y 20, pues vamos a terminar a esa hora, ¿verdad? Yo voy a estar como oyente porque tengo que preparar mis cosas para mañana. Entiendo, Jorge, muy bien. Pero gracias por quedarse al menos. Sí, gracias, gracias. Okay. Y activo. Ok, solo de escuchando, escuchando, muy bien, está bien. De Yo diez... igual, profesor, lo dejaría como oyente, pero Va. aquí voy a Ok, thank you. Ahí pueden ir a traer su cafecito y semita para <risa> quedarse más tarde. Pero, <risa> pero todavía tengo eh, 
el, el, que me, el que me diga sí, se va a ganar un trozo de semita así de este tamaño, ¿eh? porque también tengo que quedarme en la, en la entrevista. Y entre los candidat candidatos tengo a Carolina, Marcela, Ernesto, Mario, Marlon, Maybe, Otmar, ah, Saúl me dijo que ya no, ¿verdad? Y Yancy. Esos son los candidatos. ¿Hay algún valiente que se quiera quedar hasta las diez y media conmigo? Please. Ahí sí no puede ser de oyente, o tiene que, tengo que entrevistar. No, profe, está bien, yo me quedo. Ah, uh, Yancy. Sí. Con todo y zapatos se va a ir al cielo, ya sea. <risa> <risa> ok, perdón que a veces eh, hay detalles técnicos que uno no puede dominar, así que van a disculpar. Ok, good. So now we're going to work in groups. Listen, create question with WH. What, when, where, who, why, sorry, and who. He says, eh, you are going to make uh, five questions. Me van a hacer cinco preguntas, right? Starting with what, when, where, and why. Remember that when I make the question with why, the answer is going to be because, right? I will give you some examples. Look, why do you like a uh, pizza? Because it's delicious. Why do you play football? Because I like it. Why do you like... No, why do you live in San Salvador? Because it's a good place. So that is, we say why in question and because in the answer, right? Good. So we are going to make groups, right? I only need you make the, the copy of this. Solo copienme las cinco eh, WH words. Copienme las cinco WH words. Esto van a copiar nada más, ¿eh? Yes? Si quieren hacer el screenshot, pero no es necesario, solo copien ahí. What, when, where, why, and who. Ok, good. Now we're going to make the group, right? Ready? So again, in your notebooks, you are going to create five questions. And remember, you are going to make the four parts of the information question. WH word, auxiliary, subject, and verb, right? Okay, this part is difficult. Esta parte es bien difícil. Así es que vamos a concentrarnos. Uh, maybe, no sé si ya está en casita, maybe. Maybe ya llegó a casita. Bueno. Eh, Chris, ¿todavía está estado oyente, Christian? Bueno, entonces, Christian y Maybe los vamos a poner como oyentes. Los demás y todos van a participar. Ah, por aquí está el mensaje. Ok, very good. Maybe todavía sigue ahí, ¿verdad? Por el tráfico. Maybe. Ok, good. Now let's make the groups. Remember what is the task? To make five questions. Five questions. Using what, when, where, why, and who, right? Okay. I will make three groups. Name a secretary in every group. Me van a nombrar una secretaria o un representante en cada grupo, right? Este representante es el que va a copiar las preguntas. Los demás, a dictarle, a ayudarle, right? Let me see. Um, ok. Por ahí Saúl nos envió las preguntas. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Ya están los grupos, teacher, o lo vamos a hacer. No, no, ahorita lo voy a hacer yo. Ahorita les digo, yes. Ok. Group number one, please. Copy. I am group number one. I am group number two. Group number three, right? Group number one. Dagoberto, Glenda, Josué, Carolina, Mario, and Saúl. 
pesos pesados en este grupo. Ok, now. Number two, Ana María Griselda. Ana María Griselda. Eh, Jorge, Marcela, Marlon, and Yancy. Cosa seria este grupo. Ok, number two. Ana María, Griselda, eh, Jorge, Marcela, Marlon, and Yancy. Group number three. Claudia. Cristian está de oyente, ¿verdad? Pero ahí está incluido. Mario, maybe, Otmar. Bueno, entonces vamos a hacer algo. Voy a pasar a Saúl al grupo número tres, porque ahí tengo a maybe y a Cristian que están de oyentes. Sí, Saúl, lo voy a mover al grupo tres para que me les ayude. Hey, teacher. Ok, thank you. Entonces quedamos. Group number one, Dago, Glenda, Josué, Carolina y Mario. Group number two, Ana María, Griselda, Jorge, Marcela, Marlon, and Yancy. En group number three, Claudia, uh, Ernesto, Osmar, and Saúl. That's it, right? Remember, name a secretary. Por favor, nombre un secretario y él va a escribir las preguntas. No todo, solo uno las va a escribir. Okay, ready? Go. Claudia, démosle unir, Claudia, please. Claudia, ¿todo bien? ¿Pudo unirse? Like to music. What do, what do you? What do you like uh, to music? What do you? Maybe Glenda, what do you like to listen? Uh -huh. What do you like to listen music? No, no, es que si me dice music, entonces ya responde la pregunta ahí. La idea es no responder. Uh, what, what do you like to listen to? Uh, what, what do you, do you like, like to listen to? listen to? Eh, recuerden que la, el verbo <risa> listen <risa> siempre lleva atado la preposición to. Entonces, siempre tiene que decir listen to. Listen to. ¿Ok? Good. This is question. What do you, what? Like, what do you, what do you like to listen to? Uh -huh. Yeah. Así como a Glenda, que le gusta el reggaetón, ¿verdad? So... Sí, listen. <laughs> What do you like to listen? Two. Okay, number two. One, number two, continue. Mm. When do you rest in your house? Is valid, teacher? Is it okay? Yes, correct, yes. When do you rest in your house? When... Mm -hmm. Well, with the secretary, ¿quién es el secretario en este grupo? Group number two. Todos estamos tomando nota, teacher. Oh, no, 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 no. Only one, right? Tiene que ser una sola pregunta. Vamos a ver, Marcela va a ser la secretaria, yes? Okay, let's start with number one. What? What, right? Oh what? So, what is the question? Ayúdenme a Marcela, chicos. What? Eh, is your favorite? 
Food. Ok, ok, good. Pero, pero el verbo to be lo vamos a dejar. El, el verbo to be lo vamos a dejar afuera. En lugar de, de is, vamos a usar do, right? Do. O da. What do you? Mm -hmm. What do you? Favorite food. Mm -hmm. Pero cuando digo favorite, favorite, favorite food, food. ¿Qué hacemos con la comida favorita? La comemos, la cocinamos. Entonces, la pregunta es, ¿qué? ¿Qué hago con la comida? Eat. What do you eat? What do you eat? Podría ser. Yes. Esta podría ser. Es una opción. What do you eat? ¿Qué es lo que comes? What do you eat? And then the answer is, I eat my favorite food. Ahí sí respondo. I eat oh. my favorite food. Uh -huh. eh, ¿Les parece esta? What do you eat? Yes. Yes, vale. Muy bien. Ahí, secretaria Marcela, please, copy. Y recuerden las cuatro partes. What do you eat, right? Good. Next one. Where, where do you live? Where do you live? Oh. Oiga, Marcela, ¿qué le parece esa respuesta? Hey. Where do you live? ¿Está bien? Ok, teacher. Va, cópiela, pues, porque cuando vayamos a la sala principal me lo van a decir. Where do you live? Ya tienen dos, le faltan tres ahí. Ok. Good. Los dejo porque voy a ir al grupo tres. Yes. Ok. Ok. Sigan ustedes solitos ahí, ya. Yeah. Que no sé. Hay play en the weekend, correcto. Ajá. Congratulations, I say only the question. Solo pedí la pregunta, pero ustedes van con la respuesta ah, también. Excellent, no? good, good, excellent. <laughs> Don't stop. Continue, continue. What do you go to the cinema? I go to the cinema with my wife. With my wife. Yes. You miss the preposition. Solo que ahí les hace falta la preposición. Who do you go to the cinema with? Esta preposición mm -hmm. with va en la pregunta. Mm -hmm. Ah, ok. Yes. Si utilizamos la preposición with. Es al final de la pregunta. La... Al final. In the question. Yeah, in the question. Mm -hmm. Es with. With. Ah. With. With, eh? with, no, no, ahí, bórreme guay. In the, ahí, en, ahí. With, en, en, en the question. In the question. En, sí. en the question, en, en el final va uh, with. With. Yes, yes, with. 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 No wife, no. With. With. No se casen, no se casen todavía, no, todavía no. <risa> with, disfruten la vida. To... Todavía no, disfruten la vida. Ahí. <risa> ahorcado estamos ya, teacher. Ok. Like to study. No, porque el 5 era. Ajá, el 4 era. Why do, you... Why do you like to study English? Ajá. Y la 5 es. Who do you live with? Ajá, con quién vive. Do you, who do you like with? Who do you live with? Ajá, que será con quién vives. Está bien, teacher. Yes, of course. Perfect. Yes. You finish? Yeah, finish. Check again. I, I will go to group number two and in a minute we come back to the main room, right? Regresamos a la sala principal en un minuto, ¿ok? Ok. Good. Déjeme chequear el grupo okay. dos y terminamos. How. Oh. How, gran jefe. <laughs> ok, pero how no está en, la pre en las preguntas. <risa> miren, ángalo, pero miren, ahí está, dice, what, when... No, me estaba recordando, Tichu. Ah, ok, good. That's ok. No, pero si quieren, háganlo, no hay problema, yo no les pongo límites. Saben que el grupo 3 está contestando las preguntas de una sola vez. Ustedes mandan aquí, ¿verdad? ustedes 
Si quieren contestarlas, pues contesten. Si no, pues así dejémoslo, ¿ok? ¿Estamos listos? ¿Nos vamos a la sala principal ya? Sí, listos, teacher. Okay, let's go, let's go. Group number one, please. Question one. What do you like to listen to? What do you like to listen, to, listen to? to? And Mario, what do you like to listen to? Reggaeton, no. Classical, no, no, no. Classical. Of, Classical, uh, Chopin. 80s. 80s, 90s. So, Pan. Y en inglés. Sí, sí, sí. Nos va a caer un rayo si mencionamos eso. Sí, nombre. sí, se va a cortar otra vez la transmisión, pero se corta. Sí. Ok, no, no me ofendan a Glenda, que a ella le gusta mucho esa música. Ya es, ok, good. Now, number two. Group number two, please. Where do you live? Where do you live, right? Where, where do you live, Marcela? San Salvador. I live in San Salvador. You live in San Salvador. Okay, yes. good. Number three. Group number three. Group number three. Ready? When do you play soccer? When do you play soccer? Uh, Saul, when do you play soccer? In the Sunday and Saturday. Okay, very good. You play on Saturdays in La Gambetta, no? Oh, in my Polideportivo. Polideportivo. On Saturdays, when? So when? On Saturdays in Polideportivo. That, that's good, right? Now, question number four, please, group number one. Group number one. Why do you like to study English? Excellent. Also, why do you like to study English, right? Study English. Why? Why do you like to study English, Mario? Because it's interesting. Because it's interesting. Very good. Because it's interesting. Okay, question five. Group number two. Group number two, please. Who do is your teacher? Who is your teacher? Mm -hmm. Ok, pero aquí estamos regresando al verbo to be, ¿verdad? No. Who do is your teacher? No sé si está bien formulada la pregunta. Ah, pero estamos combinando aquí agua y aceite. Mire, who do is. Entonces, esto no podría ser. Pregunte mejor qué hace su profesor, ¿verdad? O, 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 o con quién estás aprendiendo inglés. O quién eh, te ayuda. O a quién, a quién escuchas en tu clase. Algo así, no sé, pero, pero, pero tiene que haber una acción. O sea, no, no, no tiene que ser el verbo to be. Ok. ¿Cuál podría ser la pregunta? Veamos. Tú...
¿Con, con quién estudias, por ejemplo? Podría ser, ¿verdad? ¿Con quién estudias inglés? ¿Eh? Podría ser, ¿con quién estudias inglés? ¿Cómo, ¿Cómo diríamos esa pregunta? ¿Con quién estudias inglés? Who do you study? Who do you study? With. With, right? ¿Con quién estudi estudias? Ok, so the answer is my teacher. Right? Okay. Understand? Okay, yes. Yes. Sí, porque si yo digo who is your teacher, estoy usando el verbo to be. Y aquí estamos usando el presente simple. Mira, aquí ya está, ¿ve? Do. So, who do you study, right? Four part, remember, four part. Who do you study with, right? Okay, thank you very much. We finished, right? We finished this part. Now we're going to go to the presentation. To the presentation, right? Mm -hmm. The presentation for today. En unos minutos voy a pasar lista y me dicen quién se va a quedar los 20 minutos solo escuchando y quién se va a quedar los 20 minutos solo participando también, ¿ok? Good. And again, I'm sorry, perdón que por, por mi culpa van a costar 20 minutos tarde, but I tried, right? Lo intenté hacer lo mejor, así que la tecnología me hoy me, me echó zancadilla. <ríe> ok, ya tenemos a Maybe por ahí. Welcome, Maybe. La veo cansadita, ¿verdad? Siempre sale corriendo a la clase. Yes. Sí, sí. Ok. Cuidado ahí, ¿verdad? No me la vayan a atropellar o algo por venir corriendo. Oiga. No. Okay. no. <risa> ya, ya estamos en casa. Ya estamos aquí. Gracias a Dios, ¿verdad? Ok. Now, let's go to the presentation. Ok. Okay, very good. Uh, this class is class number 12. Today is November 15. How to use simple present information question, right? More practice. Ask questions about someone's duties, obligation, right? Duties is obligations, responsabilidades, obligaciones, right? Duties at the workplace. So what are your duties? What are your obligations in your company? What are the obligations for Ana Maria in uh, Inversiones Educativas, right? What are the obligations for Claudia in Ayala y Alfaro? What are the occupation for Glenda in Teleperformance? What are the occupation for, for Mario in Presidencia de la República? No, ah, no, sorry, Mario. <laughs> no, Mario. Mario is in, in... Of course. Of course, right? Yes. Amado Naun, right? Esa es a Colegio Bautista Emanuel. Ah, Emanuel. Oh, sorry. Excuse me, Mario. Sorry. Yes. So, what are the duties? ¿Cuáles son las obligaciones de Mario? Okay? So, now, let's go. Listen to the question. What do you have to do on Thursday? I just check the production for the new products and write a report about it. Why? Because, notice why? Because, right? Because I need someone to help me with some boxes. Uh, sorry, uh, help me move some boxes. Can you do me a favor? Uh, sure. What is, that? What, what is it about? What is it about? What does Mr. Ruiz have to do that day? What does Mr. Ruiz have to do that day? And it says, mm, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. What time does he finish to work on Thursday? Or when does he have free time? Again, but now repeat after me, please. Repeat after me. What do you have to do on Thursday? I just check the production for the new product. And write a report about it. 
about it. Ba, 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 about it. Why? Why? Because I need someone to help me move some boxes. Because I need someone to help me move some boxes. Can you do me a favor? Can you do me a favor? Sure. What is it about? What is it about? What is it about? What is it about? What does Mr. Ruiz have to do that day? What does Mr. Ruiz have to do that day? I'm not sure. What time does he finish to work on Thursday? What time does he finish to work on Thursday? Or when does he have free time? Very good. Now we'll take the attendance. Vamos a tomar la asistencia, right? Y me dicen quiénes se van a quedar de oyentes y quiénes se van a quedar activos. A las 10 y 20 terminamos. Y uh, se me queda después Yancy otros 10 minutos. Thank you, Yancy. Okay, good. Eh, Ana María. Yes. yes. ¿Se va a quedar activa o oyente? Activa. Okay. Thank you very much. Good. Eh, Claudia. Uh, yo ya no juego, profe. No, vaya, está muy cansadita. Eh, eh, pero se va a quedar de oyente, Claudia. ¿O no? Eh, sí. Okay. Okay. Tal vez okay. en lo que cuelgo la ropa, porque igual tengo que colgar. <laughs> ok, <laughs> me gusta. Sí. Ok, very good. Thank you, Chris. Presente, Bien. voy a estar activo. Activo. Sí, Thank señor. You, Chris. Ok, excelente. Okay, very good. Eh, Dagoberto. Dago. Active. Active. Thank you. Eh, Glenda. Present. Active or listener? Active. Excellent. Eh, Griselda? Present. Salido oyente. Okay, good. Oyente, good. Eh, Jorge? Oyente, teacher. Okay, I know, I know. Eh, Josué? Present. Estaría de oyente. Okay, good. Thank you, Josué. Thank you. Eh, Carolina? Eh, eh, aquí, aquí. <risa> allí, Estaría allí. presente, participando. Ok, thank you. Eh, Marcela. Activo. Excelente. Eh, Mario Ernesto, Ernesto. Presente, teacher, activo ahí. Eh. Ok, Mario. Solo voy a robarle un par de minutos para saldar algo y me incorporo. Ok, good, thank you. Eh, Marlon. Marlon, gente, teacher, que me va a quedar de oyente. De oyente. Good. Ahí tienen que cuidar a Alessandro por ahí, ¿verdad? That's ok. Eh, May. Present, teacher. Oyente. Ah, oyente, oh, ok. Sí. Good, ni modo, <ríe> Mañana ¿verdad? participo. Okay. Mañana. Mar, thank you. Ok, activo o oyente. Mañana. Sorry. Oyente. 
oyente, ok. Saúl. Active, good. Y Yancy también active, ¿verdad? Ok, let's do it, right? Now let's start with the conversation. Eh, Ana María and Chris. Ana María, you're Kevin. Chris, you're Albert. Ready? Action. What do you have to do on Thursday? I just checked the production for the new product and you write a report about it. Why? Because I need someone to help me. Someone? Someone? Because I need someone to help me move some box. Can you do me a favor? Sure. What is about? What is it? What is it? What is it about? Sorry. What does Mr. Ruiz have to do that day? I'm not sure. I'm not so sure. What time does he finish to work on Thursday? Or when does he have free time? Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, Doodly help me. Please clap for Chris and Ana Maria. Yes, guys. You did very well. Nice. Yippee. Yes. Okay, good. And remember, we said what time? Mm, time. Okay. Good. Now, next one. Next conversation is Dagoberto and Glenda. Dagoberto, you're Kevin. Glenda, you're Albert, right? Action. Right. What do you have to do on Thursday? I just did the production for the new product. I buy a report. I do it. Wait. About it. Wait, wait. About it. I buy a report. I okay, buy wait, wait. it. About it. A report. I buy it. Why? Because I need someone to help me move some box boxes. Can you do me a favor? Sure. What's it like? What's in it a boy? What is? What is in a neighbor? What is it? What is it? About. About. What is it about? Sure. What is it about? Excellent. <laughs> What does Mr. Ruiz have to do that day? I'm not so sure. What time does he finish to work and on Thursday? Or when does he have free time? Okie dokie. Thank you very much. Lago, Glenda, thank you very much. Now let's continue with the next one. Eh, Carolina. Carolina and Marcela, please. Carolina, you're Kevin. Marcela, you're Albert, right? Okay. One, two, three. Action. What do you have to do on Thursday? Thursday? I just checked the production for the new product production and why a report about why. Because I need someone to help me move salt boxes. Can you do me a favor? 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 Sure. What is this about? What is it? What is it about? Good. What do Mr. Ruiz have to do that day? What does Mr. Reed? What, what does? does? What does they? Mr. Reed? 
Ah, perdón. What does Mr. Ruiz have to do? What does they, perdón? And not so sure. What time do, do he? Does, does he? Does perdón. he? <laughs> what that, does he teach you to work on Thursday? Or when does she, perdón, he have free time? Thank you. Thank you very much. Right. Let's continue. Let's continue. Don't stop. Don't stop. Uh, we have uh, uh, Carolina Marcela, uh, Ernesto. Mario está de nuevo con nosotros, Mario. No, entonces Ernesto en eh, Saúl. Ernesto en Saúl. Ernesto, your Kevin. Saúl, your Albert, right? Here we go, guys. One, two, three, action. What do you have to do on Thursdays? You check the production for the new product and write a report about it. Because I need someone to help me move some boss, bosses, can you do me a favor? Sure. What is about? What is it? What is it? What is it about? What does Mr. Ruiz have to do that day? I'm not so sure. What time does he finish to work on Thursday? Or when does he have free time? Good, thank you, right? Thursday, 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 right? Okay, thank you, thank you very much. And now, uh, after Ernesto and Saul, we have Jancy and the teacher. Ta -da! Uh, Jancy, you are Kevin. I am going to be Albert. Are you ready, Jancy? What do you have to do on Thursday? I just check the production for the new product and write a report about it. Why, Jancy? Why? I oh, know, sorry. Why, Kevin? <laughs> Why, Kevin? Um, because? What? What no, do be, you? No, no, because? Uh, be, because I need someone to someone? help me. Jancy, someone? Someone to help me. Move some box. What can you do me a favor? Favor, favor, favor. Me a favor, favor. Good, sure. What is it about, Kevin? What do? What does? What does Miss Mr. Ruiz have to do that? That. Die? I'm not so sure. What's time? That's in finish to work on Thursday or when that um has free free time. When when does he have free time? When when does he have free time? When he when does he that his have free time? Have free time. Okay, very good. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> good, good. Vamos mejorando. Vamos mejorando ahí en la lectura. Yes, that's okay. Good. Now let's go to the grammar. Information question, ya dijimos que son preguntas que, cuya información aún no ha sido mencionada, right? Y a diferencia de las preguntas de sí y no, aquí no decimos yes, I do, no, I don't, no. Aquí decimos specific information. Si me preguntan what, qué, bueno. 
Where? Donde. When? Cuando. Why? Por qué. Which? Cuál. How? Cómo? De qué manera? Whose? De quién? Whom? Es a quién? Y who? Es quién? Right? Okay. With this information, look again. What is for after or concrete, right? Cosas abstractas sin concreta. ¿Qué? Okay, good. And who is for people, persona, right? Where is for places? When is for time? Whose is for possessions? The who's this cell, right? Who's this cell? The quién es este cell, right? Who's this cell? So why? Por qué? Razón, right? Okay, and which is for choice, una opción, choice, right? And finally, whom is for people, right? Pero como, no como sujeto, sino como objeto. How, de manera o forma, okay? Good. Esto ya lo habíamos visto, solo era un repaso. Perdón, aquí algo hice, ahí está. Eh, aquí había formas del verbo To be, ¿verdad? Vimos que pues no las íbamos a usar ahorita, pero ahí están como ejemplo. Este es un ejemplo. Look, what does he do? What does he do? What does he do on vacation? Right? When do you play football? When do you play? When do you play? Right? Four parts. Four. Okay. Aquí tenemos eh, las preguntas. Ya las habíamos visto. Así es que vamos a pasar aquí con el das. Okay. Anteriormente habíamos visto con el do. Ahora vamos a ver con el das. Listen. What does she do on Saturday? She visits companies and has meetings. What does she do? What? Visit. Visit other company. Where does he go on Tuesday afternoon? He goes to the company's headquarters. Company's headquarters, right? Where? The company headquarters. Which department does our boss supervise? Our boss supervise, supervises, sorry, the marketing department. What time does Miguel start to work? Miguel starts to work at nine. Okay, good. So, what? What? ¿Qué es lo que está haciendo? Es lo que preguntamos. Where does he go? So, we're asking about the place. The place, where? And which department does our boss supervise? Which department? The market department, right? And what time does Miguel, what time? Start to work at nine o'clock. It's time, right? Time. Entonces, así como es la pregunta, así va a ser la respuesta. Si me preguntan de dónde, quién, por qué, esto y lo otro, entonces así voy a responder, ¿ok? Good. Now, let's practice. Good. Here we have some example using do and does, right? Do and does. Do does. Okay. What do you need? Do you? What do you need? What do you need? And then what does she want? What does she want? Okay, four, right? Four parts. Why do they want that suit? ¿Por qué quieren este ese traje? Right? Because it's new. It's a nuevo. Why does she like this type? Because it's gray. ¿Por qué le gusta? Does. Notice, does she. No se say, do she, right? And what else? That you don't add the extra S to want and like. Vean que aquí no le agregamos la S al, al, al want ni al like. No decimos, what does she wants? Or what, why does she likes? El verbo se deja igual, right? Let's continue. What color do you want? Black. What size does he need? 
¿Qué tamaño? Right? What size? ¿Ok? Which sweaters do you, sweater do you want? Which sweater do you want? Do you? Which sweater, which shoes does she like? ¿Qué zapatos le gustan a ella? Okay. Now let's complete the question with do or does. Vamos a ver cu cuál es el correcto. Do or does, right? Let's begin, right? Uh, Jancy, please, number one. When they go to the mall. Do or does, Jancy? Hola. Number one, please. Um... When do they or when does they? When do. Do, correct. Give me a second. When do. Thank you. Number two. Saul. Do or does? Do does. Do. Sorry? Repeat, Saul. Does. Does, because it's she, right? What time does she make dinner? <coughs> what time does she singular. make dinner okay. it's singular correct and is she so we say that right thank you Saul thank you very much our next one uh, Mario please está ahí, Mario? yes I'm here okay good thank you Mario next one number three Mario how often do, do you your, or does your son tu hijo right your son Does your son. Das. Because son is singular, right? Ok, nos quedan dos minutitos. Vamos a ver si logramos terminar a tiempo esto. What time? Mar eh, Ernesto. No, Ernesto sí, está activo. Ok, Ernesto, please. Do or does. What time does your son come home? Does, right? What time does your son come home? Thank you very much. Now, let me see. Number five, please. Eh, yeah. está activo? Sería... Marcela, please. Marcela, do or, or does? Do. Do. Who often do you clear your room? Ok, permítame un segundo que aquí ya me extravié. Ah, no, aquí estamos. Do you, right? Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. Now, eh... Para terminar, vamos a pedirle a Carolina, please. Carolina, number six. What time do she go to bed? To bed, right? Okay, bed. but notice that it's she. She. She so go? Does no. or do? Do? What time? Mm. No. Which das. 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 Yes. Cheese. With mm -hmm. she is does, right? Remember, with she is does. With she and he does, right? Okay. When your teacher check your homework. When does your teacher or when do your teacher? Das. 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 Das your teacher. That. When does your teacher check your home? Okay. Das. Quiero ver si queda otra por ahí. Uh, how often do or does Francisco do the laundry? Does Francisco? Does, does Francisco. Does. Okay. Very good. Does Francisco. Very good. Now, is it clear? ¿Queda claro entonces? 
Recuérdense que esta semana, toda la semana va a ser de information question. Yes? Yes? Ok, good. ¿Queda claro que todas tienen cuatro partes? ¿Y que, queda claro cuándo vamos a usar el do y el das? Este yes. Ok, very good. That's it, right? Eh, time is over. Thank you very much. Les agradezco muchísimo por haberse quedado este extra tiempo. Les prometo que mañana de tempranito voy a chequear que todo esté en orden para no, no estarlo atrasando, ¿verdad? Unas tres horas antes voy a estar probando. <risa> ok. Good. Y preparando la semita y el coffee, ¿verdad? Ok. Have a good night. Jancy, ¿estamos por ahí? ¿Está por ahí, Jancy? Sí. Okay. Acá estoy. Thank you. Ok, los demás chicos, have a good night. Tengan buena noche, chicos. Good night, good night. Good night. Thank you. Good night. Thank you. Have a good day tomorrow, teacher. Oh, you too, you too. Thank you, thank you. Bye-bye. Take care, take care. Goodbye, Otmar. Thank you very much. Good. Eh, Jancy, ¿en, ¿en qué temas tiene dudas para ayudarle a aclarar dudas? El verbo tú. Ay, teacher, lo que pasó. Por ejemplo, en este acento que está casi no le entendí mucho. Está difícil, ¿verdad? Sí. Eh, vaya, comencemos con algo sencillo. ¿Entiende las preguntas de WH? ¿Qué quiere decir cada una? Un poco. Vaya, cuando dice when, se refiere a, a cuándo. Podría ser el jueves, podría ser el miércoles, podría ser en un año. ¿Cuándo? What time? Cuando dice what time está preguntando sobre la hora específica. What time? How often does your son play football? Does your son play football? Entonces, ¿por qué aquí usamos how often? Porque está preguntando la frecuencia, ¿verdad? La frecuencia. Es así. Cada uno de los componentes tiene un significado especial, un significado diferente. Aquí los tengo, pero ahí están, ¿ok? Mire, what, qué, who, quién, where, dónde, when, cuándo, who's, de quién, why, eh, por qué, por qué motivo, which es una opción, choice. Y whom es para personas, pero como objeto. Y por último, how es de qué manera. Okay. ¿Ya si entiende todas estas palabras? Sí, sí, sí. Y vaya, le voy a poner un ejemplo. Y usted me dice, esa lleva what? Esa lleva where? ¿Sí? Esa lleva who? Ok. Ok, ahorita vamos. Vamos a ver este. My mother. My mother. Yancy, ¿cuál de estas utilizaríamos con my mother? What? No, porque mi mamá no es una cosa. Ah. Uh, um... Ajá. Vos, vos. Who's? ¿De quién? ¿De, ¿De quién? Ah, mi mamá. No, 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 no. ¿Qué es mi mamá entonces? Es un lugar, una persona, una hora. ¿Qué es mi mamá? No, una persona. Una persona. ¿Y en dónde vamos a usar una persona? Who? Who? Ah, ok, very good. Ahora, the park. El parque, ¿cuál, cuál utilizaría aquí? The mm. park, ¿qué es el, el parque? ¿Es un lugar, una cosa? Es un lugar, es un Ajá. lugar. Entonces, ¿cuál usaríamos? Um, no. Whom es a quién? ¿A quién le damos el, la pelota? ¿A quién le damos el pisto? Ese es whom. Mm. Pero el parque, ¿cuál usamos en el parque, Yancy? ¿Qué es el parque? Vaya? Mm. 
Eh... Where? Mm, where, correct. Una más, una más. Una más. <ríe> Está difícil, ¿verdad? Le voy a poner la más sí. difícil. Ay, no. Because I like it. Porque me gusta, por eso. ¿Cuál sería la pregunta? Wows. ¿De quién? No. Estamos hablando de una posesión, no. Estamos hablando de una razón. Ah, ok, ok, ok. Um... Uy. Guay, guay, muy bien, guay, guay muy bien. <risa> so my mother is who, ¿verdad? Who? The park is where? Uh. Y because is why. Why. Ok. okay. Muy bien, <risa> ahí estamos, la primera parte. La segunda parte es cuando usar do y cuando usar das. ¿Sabe la diferencia? Eh, do, creo ¿Sí? que. Um... Recuérdese que son cuatro partes, ¿verdad? Ya analizamos la primera. Uh -huh. La primera me dice que, cuál, cuándo, quién, por qué. Esa es la primera, ¿ok? La segunda, ¿ok? Sería el auxiliar. Vamos a poner un ejemplo aquí, permítanme. ¿Sabe cuándo usar do y cuándo usar das? ¿Cuándo usar do y cuándo usar das? ¿Sabe cuándo? Do creería que es cuando es la pregunta. Sí, sí. ¿Y oh. das? Eh, También la pregunta. No, 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 no. no. Usamos el auxiliar do, but, bueno, ya analizamos este, ¿verdad? When, where, ya. Luego va el auxiliar, el auxiliar se usa para lo siguiente, Mira, se lo voy a escribir aquí, ya sé. Ahí si quiere usted le hace captura de pantalla. El do, lo vamos a usar para I, we, they, hey. you. Oh, perdón. Este es plural, ¿verdad? Vaya, cualquier nombre plural, ya en sí, vamos a usar el do. Vaya, aquí vea, mire, dice do, you. Ah, el auxiliar do va con el you. ¿Sí? Vamos a ver el otro ejemplo. Aquí. No, no, no era ese, perdón, no era ese. No da. No me dio. Bueno, perdón, qué oso. Ahora vamos a ver. Ah, aquí está. When do you play? Bueno, aquí ya lo habíamos visto, ¿verdad? Por aquí está, mire. Ok. El do lo vamos a usar con el you, con el day, mire, aquí está, do day, con algo que sea, eh, do you, you, no, aquí es, es you, otra vez, you, perdón, you también, pero ya en sí, cuando vamos a utilizar tercera persona singular, entonces ponemos das, y das va con, con she y e it y con todos los singulares todos los singulares ¿sí? ok muy bien, aquí tenemos unos ejemplos permítanme, se los voy a mostrar y creo que ya no fue los 10 minutos, ¿verdad? rapidito mire <risa> rápido, ¿verdad? Ah, aquí ya lo habíamos hecho ¿verdad? La dos, mire, la dos que hicimos. Sí, ¿no sería what time? Das, sí. Sí. Ok, ahí sería cuando usar do y cuando usar das. Luego el sujeto, bueno, ahí es un nombre, ahí cualquiera, pues el Pedro, Juan, María, etcétera, etcétera. Y por último el verbo, Yancy. Entonces son cuatro partes. 
Le voy a hacer la número uno, mire, para terminar. When do, ¿verdad? Entonces tenemos WH word, la palabra de w, que lleva WH, el auxiliar do, das, el sujeto y el verbo. Si usted se aprende esas cuatro partes, ya la hizo. Mañana vamos a seguir un poco con esto, eh, Yancy. Si tiene preguntas, deténgame. Yo le puedo explicar, ¿sí? Sí, lo okay. que pasa es que siento que me está costando un poco como a concentrarme. Esta parte es bien difícil, así es que por eso, mire, todas las clases estamos, ¿verdad? Sí. A ver si sí, les mando pero... algún video ahí para que ustedes repasen, oiga. Bye, está bien, pues, gracias. Have a good night. See you tomorrow. Good night. Bye, bye.